Paddington and the Tutti Frutti Rainbow. <coughs> One day, Mr Brown took Paddington and all the family to the seaside for a treat. Paddington sat in the front seat of the car with Mr and Mrs Brown. Mrs Bird, who looked after them, sat in the back with Jonathan and Judy. But when they got to the seaside, it was raining. They, there was a gale blowing. Some treat, said Mrs Bird, as she held on to her hat. Look, cried Paddington, that man's hair has blown away. Shh, hissed Judy, his hair hasn't blown away, he's bald. But Paddington pulled his duffel coat up round his face. He didn't want his whiskers blown away. Let's go into this cafe, said Mrs Brown. At least we'll be dry. Paddington looked back at the sea. It was very rough. I think I'll put my armbands on, just in case the tide comes in, he said. As they sat down at the table, Mr Brown pointed to a picture on the wall. It showed an ice cream called the Tutti Fruity Sunday. If you can say that, Paddington, he said, I'll buy you one as a treat. It was the biggest ice cream Paddington had ever seen. And he tried several times to say it. Toothy Fruity, Fruity Tootie, Fluty Tooty. But the more he tried, the harder it was. I think I may have a cornet instead, Mr Brown, he said sadly. It isn't easy trying to say Tutti Fruity Sunday. Everybody laughed. And because in the end he had said it properly, the girl bought him one on a, in an extra large Sunday on a tray. I couldn't get any more ice cream into the glass, she said. What a kind nurse exclaimed Paddington. She's not a nurse, said Judy. She's a waitress. Nurses look after people who are ill. If Paddington eats that, said Jonathan, he'll need a nurse. Paddington gave Jonathan a hard stare. Bears are good at eating ice cream, he said. At that moment, the sun came out. I think it's going to be a nice day after all, said Mrs. Mr. Brown. Look, there's a rainbow. Quick, Paddington, said Mrs. Brown. Look before it goes away. Paddington stared out of the window. He had never seen a rainbow before. It looks just like my tutti fruity Sunday, he said. And... It disappears nearly as quickly, said Mrs Bird. The rainbow began to fade. You must make a wish, said Judy, before the rainbow goes. Then we can play on the beach, said Jonathan. I wish, said Paddington happily, I wish I could have a tutti-fruity rainbow every day of the week.